thispersondoesnotexist.com produces a faith that has never existed before every single time you visit the website. The amazing part of this is that it generates a super clear and detailed face. So technically, the faces have no copyright or privacy invasion issues if you choose them as your business assets, which led me thinking about the potential of an AI that can generate free stock images infinitely and under your own choices. But that is not the focus today. See, this website uses an AI model called StyleGen2, which is a really well-known face generation model made by NVIDIA, and I covered an implementation of it before. The thing about using deep learning to generate faces is that inside the neural network, there are layers and layers of hidden layers that are determining the features of the face, from large details such as the nose or the mouth, to small details like the skin or even the lighting of the generated face. So here is where today's main course comes in. What if we fine-tune the layers that will affect the features and transform the AI model into generating something more unrealistic? And what you are seeing here is a modified model called Tunify. What is special about this model is that unlike normal training where people reuse the original pre-trained model, in this case that would be StyleGen2, and train with a new set of data on top of that pre-trained model to adjust the model towards something that looks more like a cartoon character. But due to the simplicity of cartoon drawings, all the hidden layers will be adjusted to be more like cartoons. But here's the problem. Even though here we can produce cartoonized facial features, but the details like the background or the skin would just look horribly wrong. So instead, Doron Adler used the idea of layer swapping introduced by Justin Pinkney to actually overcome this problem. What they have basically done is that after training a new cartoon face generating model on top of the old pre-trained model for StyleGen2, they take out the layers that generate the basic cartoon features and combine it with the layers that determine the facial details and the background lighting from the original pre-trained model for normal faces, creating this hybrid model that can generate photorealistic rendering of cartoon faces. The faces might look a bit creepy like they are staring into your soul, but this layer swapping method definitely opens up as a new solution for a variety of problems that cannot simply be solved by training an AI model. This video is sponsored by Infinite Red. Infinite Red Consulting handles your mobile, web, and AI needs. If you are looking for someone to build your app, visit and reach out at infinite.red. And lastly, thank you guys for watching. Since the Tunify model is pretty straightforward to use, I'll just link it down in the description. Join my Discord if you have any problem though. Check out my Patreon and my Twitter if you haven't, and I'll see you all next time.